On record cette fois quand même. Oh putain, je fais crash life vite. C'est vraiment horrible comment c'est instable dès que tu mets des gifs dans life speed. Hein. Ah, oh, Yana. Yeah, no. no, MST is very long. <laughs> Categories does uh, easy wrong warp AD right yeah yeah it's AD on crack without the RBA stuff basically yeah it's pretty fun though Hello. I also want to learn AD at one point just one thing at a time. to reset on ZL child. Trop tard, I guess. Yeah, hookshot is my first split. I don't like having splits in child. Because it makes me think about my early game too much. Like, I just want to get runs to adult. Oh, do you run OT as well? Or just another game? What the fuck? Ow. 
Considering you know the categories and stuff, I assume you run OT. Ah, yeah, I think. Yeah, that's the thing that can happen with speedruns, sadly. Super! Yes! Yeah, the speedrun burnout is real. When I was running uh, Ori and the Blind Forest, I would uh, get pre burned out. Not as bad as I got with Celeste, though. Celeste burned me out pretty bad towards the end. But Ocarina of Time is really fun because I don't really. Um, I don't really play competitively because I'm not at that level yet. I just kind of have fun doing the tricks and stuff. And 64 AD is pretty sick though. It's kind of kind of sad that the world record uses a VC. As far as I know, the N64 route is faster, right? Could be wrong though, my info is not very accurate. I'm very new to this whole OT speedrun thing. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, world record is VC, yeah, for sure. Because world record uh, uses a stick as adult, so it, it has to be VC, right? I think, by uh, Amata Seru. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. 112 is uh, pretty stupid as a time. Zudo is not active anymore, right? I think I see their name pop up uh, from time to time. So I wouldn't be sure. That name definitely rings a bell, though.
Allez. Pour hâte de faire un deux cycles. How old is the Zudu World Record? Because uh, Emma has been uh, the World Record holder for as long as I know. Escape dégueulasse, ça va. Hein. Oh, 2019. Okay. Yeah. yeah, I only really started following uh, Ocarina of Time in like 2021. I did watch a lot of ZFG videos before that, though. Starting up pretty well. Just hitting the tricks. First time I get good RNG on this shit, though. <laughs> last time. My last run had the, um, the rupee go on the crate. <laughs> Yeah, that crate only at night though, I think. If I recall correctly, it doesn't have anything uh, like a nice crit for gold dude. the rupee route in, uh, in 64 AD. Yeah, I really like that Seymour setup. I stole it from a Matisseru as well. What the fuck is that? Oh, 
Insane RNG. <laughs> That was some RNG, dude. Holy shit. Je préfère ça que rater. J'ai perdu genre 3 4 frais. Yes. Une frame trop tard. Oh, il était dégueulasse ce dot skip par contre. Rush. Bon, c'est pas très grave. La run est en vie. Ils 
This might be a 25 hook shot. Not sure. It might be he gets a second cycle on the uh, Ocarina Dive. Pause one frame too late after the down input. Yeah, it's only other game though, so it doesn't really matter as much. The first big mistake of the run is in Bolero. Which I skipped in PD because I forgot to split, so... I guess we'll only see the base at Entry Fire. Shot to Karina en sortant de. Ok. Une bonne bouteille au Karina en sortant de bon. I can't wait for my new joystick to arrive. This one's missing the the silicon uh, thing that's on top. It hurts my thumb if I hold up for too long. It's, it's a classic of GameCube controllers. It only took six months to wear it down to that point though, so um, kind of sad, but I got five of them this time around, so I should have enough for a while. Thanks, Nightbot. Really helps me out. Might be worth trying though, because um, I don't know how uh, Shape of Our King works. I don't know how it manages to extract the assets and stuff. Yeah, I mean, it's not like it's gonna break your computer if it doesn't work. 
Worst case scenario, you just have an unusable uh, install. C'est pas plus rapide d'aller prendre les bugs à la claque. C'était horrible celle-là. Je me suis dit, ah, ça fait longtemps qu'il n'a pas lancé de flamme, euh, c'est bon, il va m'enculer. Euh, bah voilà. Ok, c'est sub 26. Sub 26, baby. <rire> nice gold, dude. <rire> Euh, oui. <rire> ok, mec. C'est bon, ça passe. Ah, ce 
droite. Hein. Je me sache trop tout, I guess. Probably jump slashing too early. That is fine, whatever. I'm just gonna gold a bunch of splits because they're all new. But I have better times from GSR. Yeah, it's a triple slash clip. You use a hover boost to slide with the momentum from a triple slash. And then uh, you pull out hookshot or uh, a cutscene item in third person. And that gives you uh, enough speed and the right hitbox to clip through. People used to do that uh, boat skip with a launch mega flip, but it's both slower and uses one explosive and it's harder, so. I never learned the launch mega flip method. <laughs> Or three bombs, yeah. Yeah, I have no idea how the bomb method works, so. Oh wait, no. Do, do you mean the the Hess? Where you do a Hess and bomb push? Yeah, if, uh, uh, VC all dungeons this, this. It still does, because it's faster. Yeah, the Hess is garbage. It, it looks pretty, pretty bad. Pourquoi j'ai fait ça Mais non, mais je suis trop con Moi, pourquoi je drop les bugs Free time loss, yes Ah, whatever. Oh, ça devrait marcher. Yeah, it looks like the right frame. Nice bit early, make. What? Okay. <laughs> Elle a failli me pop dedans cette putain. <rire> Je vais lire tous les panneaux qui existent là. Il manque plus que celui à l'entrée, j'aurai la totale. C'est quoi là
C'est quoi le setup ici Je sais juste un flic droite. Yeah, I I suck at hessing with bottom right. Et du coup, je vais me prendre l'autre aussi là. Oh, The Hess uh, boat skip is really bad. It saves a bunch of time though. Yeah, that was nice. Pretty happy about it. I usually do that too. Oh, in this route, you don't really care because you're duping over choose uh, in forest anyway. my fault. Good thing we don't care about HP or bombs here. Je vais prendre des filles, je prends des bombes, sortir. Okay. Because we dupe over choose uh, pretty early, uh, it doesn't matter if we burn the choose anyway. So we just uh, pass all around. It's not because we don't. This route doesn't do spirit hover, so you don't need uh, as much choose. I usually don't go for uh, passes because uh, I tend to miss to uh, miss them. But uh, here it doesn't really matter. I just go for them because you have to burn them anyway. Yeah, I can I can see why. 
Personally, I am better at uh, movement tricks with. Uh, nice. I'm better at movement with uh, bombs, especially Hesses, but it doesn't matter to me. Okay. Nice <rire> J'ai vu que j'étais assez près du bord. Yeah, here I just uh, just slap a shoe on him because I don't care. I don't need to care about it. plaisir quand ça arrive ça. Oh vas-y putain. Super. Link the Goron softlocks. Love to see them. That's it for some. Parle lui, je t'en supplie. What the fuck, mon gars? So it doesn't matter. what happened here but okay
Ah oui, ok, oui, c'est bon, j'ai compris. Yeah, I... I was holding up, too, really. That's my fault. That's fine. Not a big deal. It's pretty fast to retry anyway. Voilà, du coup, ça va être le dernier de chou dont j'aurai besoin. After this one, I won't be needing any more chews. So I'll just be using bombs for the rest of the run. Allez, c'est parti Let's go fire C'est ça que me prend le cut de signe. I forgot to split again. Nice. 
Allez, ça qui part. Là, d'ici, il faut faire un tour. Parce qu'il a un gros cul, lui. to split yes ça marche ça Frérot, t'es gaucher, pourquoi tu tiens ton hookshot dans la main droite Oh, mais débile, lui aussi. Euh... Pourquoi je fais target Ça a fait le nickel. Ok. Euh... 
just like so. I saw it. Nice. Yeah, that, that was pretty nice. Yo, merci, Apso. Yeah, the minus 230 is the uh, time I gained back on the other run because my PB loses a bunch of time on Bolero cutscene skip. C'était ok comme RNG. Spawn lointain sur le deuxième, mais bon, c'est pas aussi grave que. que en 16ème, donc ça va. That minuet cutting skip is so sick, dude. I love it. It's it's not really hard to execute, it's just really cool. Uh donc là c'est quoi c'est tac 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 Ah ça qui shot tu vois ça See, that's why we need to bust all our shoes, because we just uh, blow all of them out. And we need to get the fish out of the real bottle, because, uh, jungle jump. Ah, ça va toujours pas mieux, merde, putain. Go médecin, en vrai, hein. Parce que une journée, ouais, ouais, une note, mais bon, plus ça commence à faire beaucoup. Quoi. Ah ouais, ça va mieux pour bon, ça. Va. Oh, 
tu le mec là. Tu dépêches ma partie, c'est pas grave. Oui. That was nice. A bit, uh, a bit wonky on the setup, but that's fine. I'm gonna lose time here because my PB has a really good bow. Holy nuts, nice. I want, I want these nuts. Oh really? Oh yeah, because my PV messed up the... Uh... Yeah. Yeah man, I really did. What's up Dan? Euh... Attends, c'est quoi là hop, 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 euh... Bon bouchot de fiche. Elle a dit ça. Relivie. Ou par où Je sais pas si t'étais en l'heure ou pas. Ah t'es dans le bain. J'espère que t'as kiffé. Parce que les bains c'est vraiment vraiment trop bien. I can't waste any more bombs, man. That just sucks. Oh well. Whatever. Should still save time on PD. Challenge was not a score. 
C'est vrai qu'il avait galéré sur les mobilisations. Après, ça perd pas de temps. Hein. T'es tout juste deux explosifs. This should work, I think. Cool. <laughs> well, people normally do a stupid pass here. But, uh, yeah, that's not. How do you make it? What Mais monsieur, il y a le point là Monsieur le jeu, euh, ça va pas là C'est plus autour du poteau, ah j'ai pas fait gaffe. Pas un drôle ici. sur le PV du coup, sur le PV l'a raté. Non mais sérieux, faut arrêter là Dans un moment, euh, le target du hookshot il est là pour que tu sais, euh, quand tu targetes un truc, que tu peux le hookshot en fait, hein, genre, vraiment. C'est un peu comme les poissons rouges à la foire. Ah, uh, yeah, Dan. That's true for most categories. Hondo actually has a lot of trouble damaging down for cutscene skips. Most of Adult 2 actually has Feroy's Wind on B, so it doesn't actually matter, but uh, for all of Adult 1, uh, we have like 5 or 6 hearts in Hondo. Ma faute. C'est ma faute. I mean, if you remember, um, Hondo, uh, hold on. Hondo has to um, do a lot of damaging down in forests with Bonchus. Oh, 
Yeah, it is pretty slow and annoying. Pfft, let's talk to you, so yeah. Yay! Yeah, there's safe strats for Random Ice Cavern though. Upfronters are just mad. Ah oui, c'était trop tôt, je le savais, c'est ma faute. That was my fault. I went too early. Oh, back flip ici, là. Yeah, I got an actual extended super slide. Because if you try to hess here and you're too slow, the Gui comes at you and you target him while you're hessing. And it's a mess. And I had a lot of bombs, so I just went for the super slide. But yeah, we have to do Fire Trial, um, which we require a lot of cards for, because of the Heat Timer. Most categories... Um, well, I, I take Tunic, uh, because I'm a baby, but uh, most runners don't. Alors, c'est quoi les équipes C'est bon. Ça passe ça, la vache. Euh... Euh... Four. Four. And it's really stupid. Corbiet splits! Forgot to split again. The enter X splits are so bad to split on. <laughs> I just keep forgetting about them. I'm just not used to splitting into transitions. I'll get used to it eventually though. Probably. Already at the phone, indeed. Oh, oh yeah, I'm nailed on That's a terrible RNG. That's like the worst you can get. Oh 
But yeah, it worked. That's fine. Anything is fine as long as it works. But yeah, fire trial is hard. Um, and we have to get uh, hearts because uh, we tend to lose hearts a lot because there's a bunch of enemies in trials. So even without tunic, uh, we kind of do have to get hearts. So bites. Uh. All right, bomb farming time. Uh. Uh, it's just to have something to do eye on. Yeah, it was just a medallion cutscene. Nice. Je peux jouer au jeu sinon euh. The farming here is pretty bad, not gonna lie. But yeah, we just needed something to do eye on. But a medallion cutscene skips and uh, wrong warps work in the exact same way, where you die at the red frame. But we have to get control and we do eye on the blue warp. Oh, it's just um, you uh, catch something in a bottle. And then uh, while you're in the air, you press the bottle and then another item. Okay. But yeah, if you do that, then uh, the game will just default to the Ocarina cutscene. And we do that because the game won't allow us to play the Ocarina in boss rooms. Thanks. Appreciate it. Yeah, uh, this game has aged really well. Even if you don't completely destroy it with glitches, it still it still aged pretty well. I I could see myself recommending Ocarina of Time to people. Yeah, it's a uh, the Mega Flip gives off the speed we need for a ground clip, but it's pretty hard. OT 3D has pretty sick graphics though. Uh, alors là c'est quoi C'est note uh, shot bouteille ça. So if I burst the bubble here, the game might crash uh, later. Uh, don't ask why. I really doesn't know. I really don't know why. Yeah, that was very bad indeed. Yeah, yeah, for sure. And 30 FPS as well is a nice addition to OT3D. Okay. 
I, I would say... Joystick aim on 3DS is pretty bad, but that's not the game's fault, it's just that the 3DS's joystick is pretty bad. <laughs> But yeah, for sure, the gameplay is uh, more important than the graphics. But OT3D has uh, still has the same gameplay without losing out on the well with modernized graphics, which I think is pretty cool. Yeah, gyro aim though, that is, that is really nice. It also has the legendary uh, 925 rock. Because so the devs were patching a bunch of bugs and they realized that uh, you could get into bottom of the well early as child. And they were like, yeah, we don't want that, so... Um, while the well's not drained, we're just gonna add the giant rock in front of it. But they forgot to add the rock at night. So we just call it the 9 to 5 rock because uh, he's an office worker. It's a pretty cool piece of trivia. Yeah, the rock's on the grind, man. Sorry. But yeah, uh, for people who want to play OT, I would actually recommend the 3D release. Majora's Mask, not so much because. Uh, Majora's Mask has a lot of weird stuff that they changed after the um, the three DS version. Like they made Deku really slow. They made uh, Zoro swimming cost m magic for some reason. You're scared of? She's scared of heights. What can you do? I almost fell down. Wow. I barely missed it! Dang. <laughs> barely missed the Vibrudo. <laughs> There's a really funny glitch you can do here. If you put Rudo on the right spot on the chest, she falls down every frame, but then the chest um, catches her, and that plays her uh, falling animation every frame and she just vibrates. It's really funny. It also softlocks her. It's quite as equipped, you see. Here it is! Our best boy! The true final boss.
I almost died. Okay. I think he died in the right spot. So I'm gonna to do a wrong warp, and the place where the blue warp is depends on Baronet's position on death. So... Yep, there it is, it's inside the right spot. It's near the door. This is the hard part. Okay. Let's go. Let's go, dude. <sighs> nice. Uh, this trick is so good. Alright, uh, thanks for the raids. Uh, good Gorto, Chef. I hope the MQ race went well. Uh, so what happened is I got the blue warp to make me exit the area right as I uh, was exiting the room. And so uh, the game essentially tried to spawn me into two locations at the same time. And uh, it gets messed up and uh, it loads the completely wrong area. Basically. Uh, it's called the wrong warp. Uh, I, I had only one try at it. And because uh, Rudo's in the blue warp, you have to do a bunch of shenanigans to, uh, to break free from it. It's just a really hard, yeah, exit the room on the same frame and it works. Yeah, yeah, it's because of Rudo. Right. Okay, uh, I think it's Bombs who shot for Roy's wind here. Pop, 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 j'abuse Rongoire, c'est où Bon bookshot for Roy's wind, right, c'est ça. And here's another wrong warp. Uh, we're using Feroy's Wind this time. And here we are in the Silver Gauntlet cutscene. But yeah, uh, so because Rudo's in the blue warp, you have to first die, get revived by a fairy. So that puts you inside the blue warp, but you don't talk to Rudo. Um, because the game's waiting for you to face Rudo. And so what we're doing is we're dying, and we're uh, putting our health back again, so we can die another time. And 
we target Rudo and then um, Druid Trick called Walking While Talking to um, get out of the blue warp while we die. And so uh, that means when we, that means we can control when the text box launches the warp, because the text box is what actually launches the warp. Yeah, most blue warps you can just trigger with offering items. This next split is also stupidly hard, so hopefully it goes well. Almost got back and bound, but we're fine. Now. I mean, I I knew Stider Climb already from um, GSR. Statue Climb was not what I was having the most trouble with learning. But yeah, I routed it all the hard shit. <laughs> It was a lot of fun learning all the tricks for this. Uh, c'est quoi les equips là? Bon bouchot de fiche. Save time. I had to set it up once again, but uh, that's fine. It still saves time over uh, not getting the skip at all. 
Because if you don't get this, you don't void out and your health is not set up properly for the next uh, cutscene skip. I had to dupe the bomb drop in the, in the upper region though, so I lost a bit of time to that, so it's nothing too bad. Alright, everyone's favorite fight of the game. I lost like 30 seconds to uh, Twin Rova sisters deciding that they would just not shoot. So hopefully I get better RNG this time. I think the, the one in that PV was actually the worst RNG that I ever had on Twin Rova. I've seen worse, but I've never had that bad. Double? Yes! Double! Triple? No. Thanks, so, so. Well, that's some really good RNG, though. Yeah, that... That is some big RNG, this is true. Uh, I think Ice gonna shoot. Yeah. Okay. She was gonna shoot again, I think. So I just uh, give her a uh, hookshot scare. Surely I can get one cycle, right? What's the worst that could happen? Yeah, that was really fast. <laughs> that was really, really fast. It wasn't perfect, but it was really fast, yeah. They shot really quickly. messed it up. I should get into the habit of uh, doing this, like doing double taps for the crab stabs. So even if I crab stabbed really, I, uh, I can still get it. Yeah, that was spooky. I think if I missed one more crab stab, that would have been it. Yo, thanks, Rego. Uh, if you jump slash really early, you do have that leniency, yeah. But it's really close. Fish in time. What's the initial setup for this one? I think that's it. Really fucking good. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay, dude. That was some RNG. Ready, Spit. Uh, I think I'm just equip for always went here, right? Hold on. Uh. Yeah. 
Euh, bomb stick hammer. Pretty slow reset, but that's fine. Dude, we're schmoving. I haven't messed up anything big so far. Yeah, it's really cool. It's really, really cool. <laughs> Congrats on our dragon chef. <laughs> so true. Legendary keyboard glitchless word record. Okay, I'm gonna go toilet. I'll be right back. <laughs> Okay. Even managed to sneak in a hand wash. I'm just that good. I mean, Chef used to have the actual glitches for record, so he's pretty good at this game. 353 is pretty nuts, though, <laughs> on keyboard for a first round, especially. This guy sent me a clip of Shadow Trial Hess on keyboard. <laughs> 3 3 x sounds really hard though. <laughs> Nice. Nightbot's reacting to Dan's message. You love to see it. Human as always. Yeah, even Nightbot knows. <laughs> and to be fair, I didn't have a controller until like 2020 when I played Ori. So I literally did not see a need for it. I was just playing Celeste on keyboard. And I played everything on KBM. I mean, casually it works, yeah, I guess. If you can emulate gyro aim as mouse on the 3DS version, uh, mouse could actually be really good. Minecraft Alpha, wow. Good times. I, I played Minecraft, I think the first Minecraft version I played was 1.2. Yeah, 1.2.5. Minecarts were barely just introduced. Good times. Et yo, Badzirkis. Badzirkis, pardon. Light arrows. Nice. So the thing that I liked most about this rock, Grego, is that. Um, Trials are right after light arrow cutscene, so you have five-ish minutes to just uh, mentally prepare yourself for trials. Is that a vanilla update, Dan? I thought it was a mother thing. 
Oh, like, uh, just, yeah, they slowly disappeared. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I remember there's a mod that makes it much faster. But they just decay over time in vanilla. Okay, allez, let's go, faire les trial. Yeah, yeah, it didn't disappear at all. Yeah, I gotcha. Allez, c'est parti pour l'enfer. Je suis déjà nerveux alors que c'est ma deuxième run ever. J'imagine pas les pauvres gens qui sont en euh, World Record Pace. Ah, c'est vrai qu'il faut jouer aussi. Is this gonna work? It was not gonna work! <laughs> Ok. Allez. J'ai failli void comme une grosse merde. Ça aurait été incroyable. What the fuck la caméra Non, c'est pas ça. C'est bomb lighter ou shot. Et il est over. Ok. Yeah, it had to be vanilla, yeah, as I thought. Yeah, that was cutie right there. That was cutie. We just keep the as long as you don't uh, add anything else to your crouch tab, uh, your cutie value stays the same. So you just keep the fire, and we keep the ISG as well. So we get to keep the fire cutie. As long as you don't reload the scene, that is. Nice. <laughs> C'est pas grave, pas très très grave ça. Okay. 
I lost a minute to that jump and uh, PB. Alright, the pain starts now. Yeah, that is exactly how it is. Hey! Let's go! Shadowfire, les deux triables de merde. Sérieux, putain, j'ai raté le buffer. Ah, c'est ma faute. Yes, the SS of my life, dude. Okay, we're through. <sighs> Jesus Christ, dude. Yeah, it could have been way worse, for sure. No, pas le mèche! C'est bon. It could have gone way, way worse than it just did. Only lost one bomb to it. Like 20 seconds, I think. Whoa, what the fuck is that? Oh shit, dude! What? <laughs> My foot. Why is bar? I'll just wait out the cycle. I'm gonna play super safe. Okay. Can you imagine doing that on a timer, Dan? Okay. 
Okay, let's go. No. Oui. I think what I'm doing here, Chef, could be qualified as gaming, actually. Yeah, it is much faster, but it's way less cool. <laughs> I love that uh, block skip. Yeah, that it saves like uh, 10 seconds, I think, over throwing the block. Even if nice. Even if you um, have golden gauntlets. And hammer over slides are pretty cool. Oh la vache, c'est nul à chier. J'ai fait de la merde là. Bonsoir. Oui. Oh, Caméra dans cette salle de merde. OMG. Le dernier. Could have been way worse, I guess. Yeah, this camera sucks, dude. All right, that's fine. Yeah, you have to press the switch and then go back. It's pretty annoying. No, I just said shit camera. <laughs> yeah, for sure, chef. <laughs> That's great trials one of the easiest, but uh mm. Après, I guess. That was a weird route. Nice. That was pretty fast. I'm probably losing time for this free trial on my PD because it's uh, pretty much flawless. But... Toujours c'est pas dur mec. Voilà. Yeah, bow extension is really cool. Hey. 
Alright, that's one way to get magic, I guess. <laughs> Alright, run's not over, I still have the two really hard tricks left. I'm gonna farm and cook here for us, I think. Just one drop. Yeah, the swipe pot, of course. Up right out of here. Uh, deck, deck. So you may have noticed that I use the same Ferrari's Wind War Point twice. That's because if you use Ferrari's Wind and then uh, uh, exit the game, the Ferrari's Wind stays here. Or like save while it, before it disappears. Uh, cool emulator freeze, okay. I said it would farm. What am I doing here? Actually, fuck it. So I'll just follow it. It's not worth it. I'll just go farm. One more drop just to be safe. It's not like my run will die if I go get that bomb drop. And I got two drops! <laughs> okay! I guess the game is telling me to go get the, the bomb drops and that it was a good idea after all. Introducing mustache clip. My foot. C'est trop tôt. That clip is really cool. Yeah, I'm not doing Deku Hess. <laughs> I'm not touching Deku Hess with a 20 feet ball. Okay, should work. Nice. Alco Hess? Oh, you mean the one that you just start from next to it? Eh. I just don't really like Deku Hess. Like, Hessing into Deku. Okay. <sighs> oh, yeah, that, yeah, the, yeah, okay, I think I see which one you're talking about. <sighs> Mais, frère, j'ai fait quelque chose deux fois, va te faire foutre aussi. Dude, I flicked the shield twice. Like, hello? Uh, it's quoi les equip là du coup? Uh, did I heal? Uh, did I hold? Okay, I swear I. Okay. Eh oui, mais... J'ai roll trop tard. Ça va pas marcher. 
Let's roll. Uh, this is where you find bomb drops. Okay. Voilà, j'avais juste à faire ça. Hein. Ah, tu like 10 tries. Ah, whatever. Whatever. Worst case scenario, I don't do the super slide uh, to Ganon. It'd be a pain, but whatever. Ah merde, c'est notre fiche bombe. J'ai les bombes sur droite. Yeah, I wanted because I, I wanted to dry roll while holding shield, but it's probably not a good idea. Because that's how I'm used to doing mega flips. I just shield drop and then while um, keeping R held, I roll. J'aimerais bien avoir les bons équipes, s'il te plaît. Kill scout. C'est une frame late, ça. Hein. Ouais. Go. Yeah, Dan, you're right. Okay, this is where I save a bunch of time. Ganon split shouldn't be 16 minutes long. Gotta have to practice Deku though.
Run's not over. It's not over at, until the final slash from Ganon. Oh god, the lag. <laughs> Holy shit! It runs at 8 FPS. Okay, it's better now. Oh, really, Chef? That's pretty funny. I'm sure it's never happened to you, though. Mm -hmm. We're shielding, boys. Alright, so my PV does something really funny here. Um, I... I was holding shield, and I was like, wait, the firewall's there, I can release shield, and I just released shield, <laughs> and had to do the fight with hammer. It was pretty funny. Alright, this is when you can release shield. Uh, okay. I thought I'd just gotten a VC crash, dude. It would have been honestly pretty funny. Ganon avec des couches stables, c'est vraiment l'enfer. Let's fucking go, dude. Let's go, putain. Ça, c'est de la run, mon gars. Ça, c'est de la run. Let's go. Bon. Uh, I have no idea then. I think it's like 40 seconds off the top of my head. Because you have the cutscene where Link holds his sword in front of him. Thanks on the GG's. Much appreciated. Oh, this category is so much fun to run, man. I'm so glad I farmed the bomb drops in Cookery Forest. Yeah, I wanted to play it safe. I mean, I could have just saved and reset if I really missed the Mega Flip too much, but that would have been a pain.
Dude, hitting the tricks is so satisfying. I was so nervous during the collapse skip. But I remember to just hold shield for long enough that it worked. So Chef, the thing with the the dry roll on the mega flip here is uh, when I do a mega flip, I'm used to uh, pulling a bomb, shield dropping the bomb, and then instantly dry roll backflip. So I'm not used to just dropping the bomb, releasing shield, and then dry roll backflip, which has uh, fucked me a lot of times here. <laughs> And then the roll timing was terrible. I forgot how many flashes I had to count. I think it was four, but uh, I messed it up. I don't buffer that roll because you have a bunch of frames that work. It's like five or six frames that work. Qu'est-ce que c'est trop bien le MST, sérieux C'est vraiment incroyable. Bon, je pense que j'ai fait du JSR pendant aussi longtemps en me disant que c'était intéressant. En fait, le MST, c'est le JSR, mais en mieux, quoi. <rire> c'est incroyable. Let's see, where's the time save here? Child was decent, uh, not like Child Matters anyway. Shadow Temple was pretty good. Uh, a lot of things happened, so... I messed up Collapse Skip in my OPB. So I had to uh, go back from the safety save I made before even uh, beating Goma. Like if you, so if you mess up collapse skip, uh, if you jump slash too late, you void out, and that respawns you in some really weird spot in Deku Tree, so you can't even try it again. You have to save in, you have to save warp. Uh, not even save warp, just have to um, go back from your last safety save. And um, I messed up Goma fight. I, mean, I didn't mess up the fight, but I uh, right after I respawned, I did door crush like usual. And I, uh, I did the setup for Ganondor and then forgot to dry roll before the backflip, so I just walked inside the blue warp. <laughs> and then, uh, uh, whatever happened with Ganon. <laughs> yeah, I had to do Ganon fight uh, with Hammer. So yeah, that's everything that happened in that split. It was pretty bad. Classic case of a uh, late game splits being less practiced. Because when I learn a category, I usually, at the end of learning sessions, I usually go through everything that I've learned. Um, so the muscle memory builds up, and uh, that shows. Because the late game stuff, I'm much more sad than the early game stuff. It's I think it's painfully obvious here. So yeah, uh, Shadow was decent, uh, Bolero was good, uh, Fire was nice, I forgot to split here in my last BB, so Bolero doesn't have a split, but um, I would be like uh, two and a half minutes ahead at Enter Fire here. Uh, fire was good, Hammer was good, I missed the Hess going through the Flame Dancer, but it doesn't lose that much. Uh, Volvagia was good. I, what happened here? Oh yeah, I think I took a bunch of time to buff or something. Oh yeah, yeah, I messed up Equip Swap a bunch for the Zelda's letter. Uh, Bell was good. Uh, Phantom Ganon was good. Uh, even though I was down to explosives, it wasn't a big deal. Uh, water was pretty good. Aside from terrible RNG and bomb drops, but that's not up to me. Uh, and Church Jabu, same thing about RNG. 
Jabu is nice. Uh, Jabu wrong warp worked, first try. Nothing to complain about, so was Spirit. Twin Rover Aranji was insane in that round, dude. I got a double and then uh, two other quick shots. Trials were good, uh, aside from Shadow Trial, which I messed up a bit, uh, and Avoid on Fire Trial. Uh, Shadow Trial wasn't too bad though, it was only a second try on the Hess. Uh, Deku was uh, painstakingly awful. Tried the Mega Flip like 10 times. And then Ganon was Ganon. Uh, MST means medallions, stones, and trials. Oh, uh, I might have gone through while the stream was down. I was buffering a bit. Uh, MST is uh, medallion, stones, trials. So that means uh, we have to collect all the spiritual stones. So we have to beat all the child dungeons. We have to collect all the medallions. So we have to complete all the adult dungeons and um, get light medallion. And we have to do all the trials in Ganon's castle. Which is why uh, I did the trials here, even though I wrong worked to Ganon's castle collapse at the end. Because you just have to do the trials for the category requirements. Because you have to lift the barrier uh, in front of uh, Ganon's castle. It's a pretty cool category, because you get to see all dungeons, uh, it's also pretty long. Because Ocarina of Time has this weird, annoying thing where early game is a bit annoying, because you have a bunch of cutscenes, you have the Zelda's Letter cutscene, you have a Master Sword cutscene. So it's, it's not really interesting. Um, when you get to adult is when the run really starts going, and then after this point you have a bunch of gameplay. Whereas other categories like GSR, uh, Ganondorf source requirements that only complete Shadow and Spirit Temple, uh, they don't they, they don't have as much gameplay after Child. So yeah, cool category. The only category that shows up more is 100%. I mean, the only uh, leaderboard category. Old Dungeons is also a thing um, where it doesn't um, it doesn't require you to do the trials, but Old Dungeons also allows a glitch called the uh, RBA, Reverse Volatile Adventure, which um, gives you a lot of items. You can get a lot of uh, quest items like songs and medallions uh, thanks to having a bottle on your B button. Uh, so it's a it's a really different run, so you get to have a bunch of items on B. It's, it's, it's a very cool run, but uh, I personally prefer this one. Yeah, RBA is banned in MST, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's just banned. That's the main difference between MST and all dungeons, aside from trials. Yeah, you can RBA medallions and stones, so you have source requirement, and RBA is just flat out banned. Like, you can't uh, do hammer on B like uh, all dungeons does. Yeah, I, I get to warm up with this one, yeah. My end goal is, uh, long term, is to warm up with MST and do 100% long, long term. Because uh, Ocarina of Time 100% is really, really cool. <laughs> 